Welcome to Marbella, Spain, known for its nightclubs and pristine beaches. Now this video will provide 10 reasons why people love Marbella. Yeah, 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 yeah. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to Marbella, Spain. Population around 150,000. Now just for context, we have a map here, we have circled Marbella. Marbella is one hour from Gibraltar and one hour from Malaga. Now this video will provide 10 reasons why people love Marbella. People love Marbella because of Plaza de los Naranjos. In Marbella's charming old town, the Plaza de los Naranjos is the place where locals and tourists come to socialize and relax. A number of attractions line the square and several restaurants with outdoor patio seating are set beneath leafy trees. This beautiful town square has become the heart of Marbella. The Plaza de los Naranjos blossoms with fragrant orange trees in springtime. The group of orange trees is planted right in the middle of the square, providing welcome shade during the summertime. Two important historic landmarks found here are the Town Hall, built in 1572, and the oldest parish church in Marbella, the 16th century Santiago Hermitage. This simple whitewashed church possesses a noteworthy contemporary sculpture of St. James the Apostle. A nearby attraction for food lovers is the Restaurante Esquina, which holds two Michelin stars. People love Marbella because of the Paseo de la Alameda. Filled with leafy palms and shady pine trees, the Paseo de la Alameda is a peaceful public park in the Old Town that joins the Paseo Maritimo along the seafront. It's a delight to wander through here after spending time in the Old City with its narrow streets. The park features a main promenade with marble walkways, decorative benches shaded beneath banana palms, and fountains that were made in 1762. The park is also home to botanical gardens and it was the city's first designated green space. A small kiosk located in the southern part of the park sells cold drinks, snacks, newspapers, and magazines. People of Marbella because of the beaches. Marbella's name means beautiful sea and the town lives up to the moniker with fine sandy beaches. Several excellent choices are within a short walk of the historic center of Marbella. Most of the public beaches have restroom facilities and lifeguards on duty during summer. Playa Casablanca should be number one on your beach list. Beautiful sand, a happening scene, and a palm tree walkway make the area a place to see and be seen. The beach is pleasantly busy but not overrun. If you want to stay here, check out the very high-end Marbella Club. Coming in a close second to Playa Casablanca is Playa Real de Zaragoza. This wonderful beach is a mix of natural areas and built-up spots. The beach is the perfect width for the formation of wonderful shallow tidal pools of warm water, a favorite for families with small children. The beach also has its fair share of chair rental places. A favorite for those staying in the Old Town or in the heart of Marbella is Playa de Venus. Find it easily at the end of Avenida del Mar, just past all the amazing Salvador Dali artwork. The beach is very busy with people enjoying the sun, sand, and shallow calm waters. People love Marbella because of Porto Benes. About 10 kilometers from the old town, Porto Benes is a fashionable marina in Marbella where the jet set crowd comes to see and be seen. Stylish restaurants and upscale boutiques line the waterfront. Oddly, you'll also find vendors on the street selling cheap knockoffs. The restaurants have outdoor terraces for the perfect seaside ambiance. You can eat dinner while watching luxury yachts bob up and down in the harbor. With hundreds of berths, four yachts and other boats, Porto Benes is considered one of the best yacht marinas in Spain. The marina also offers boat rentals and many sailing trips and other tours leave from here. Porto Buenos is an odd sort of place filled with the haves and the haves nots. The luxury shops line the waterfront area, but only 50 meters away is a down market area of cheap establishments and kebab stands. People love Marbella because of Avenida del Mar and the Dali statues. 
Art lovers will want to make time for a stroll down Avenida del Mar, a lovely pedestrian way that stretches from the Paseo Maritimo to Park Alameda. It serves as an outdoor showcase with a permanent exhibition of Salvador Dali's imaginative bronze statues, including 10 Dali works. The pedestrian avenue is in an area where prominent residents once came to show off their decorative carriages. In the 1990s, the space was converted into a modern promenade, but is still a popular place to visit for locals and visitors. A large parking lot is located beneath Avenida Del Mar, and is an excellent place to park when visiting the city center and beaches. People of Barbea because of the Church of the Incarnation. The Church of the Incarnation is the most important church in Marbella's old town built in the 16th century by the Catholic monarchs. The church stands on the site of a former mosque of Marbella. It was common practice in the 16th century Andalusia to replace the mosque with new churches. The building features a spacious basilica plan with a barrel vaulted central nave and a semicircular apse with Corinthian columns. A distinguishing feature of the facade, the main door is exquisitely carved from ochre stone in Rococo style, an 18th century enhancement. The sanctuary boasts a Sol Mayor organ, considered the finest type of modern organ built in Spain. The church is open to the public daily free of charge for cultural visits and prayer. Mass is celebrated here throughout the week with two services daily Monday through Saturday and several services on Sunday. People of Marbella because of the old Moorish castle. The castle stands as the last remains of the old Moorish citadel, the fortified castle and city. These immense walls with two towers are the only relic of the Muslim civilization in Marbella. The walls date back to the 10th and 11th century, the Moorish Caliphate period. They were restored in early 1735 and remain in good condition. Although there is nothing to visit within the walls, it is definitely worth taking a look. The enormous proportions of the wall hint at the ancient citadel's grandeur. People of Marbella because of Museo Rale. Between Porto Banas and Marbella Old Town, the Museo Rally is a worthwhile excursion about a 10 minute drive away. The Rally Museum is housed in a completely renovated building with 10 spacious exhibition rooms. This museum is part of the Rally Museums, a group of other branches in Porto del Este, Uruguay, Santiago, Chile and Hafei in Israel. The Rally Museums boast one of the world's best collection of Latin American art. At the Marbella Musee Rale, visitors will discover an extensive collection of works by contemporary artists from a variety of Latin American countries. The paintings on display reflect the influence of the great European masters. People of Marbella because of the Spanish Contemporary Engraving Museum. This renowned art museum is another top attraction in Marbella's old town. The museum occupies the Bazan Hospital, an elegant Renaissance Gothic building founded in the 16th century and registered as a protected historic monument. Admission is free. The only museum of its type in Spain, the Spanish Contemporary Engravings Museum, is devoted to the preservation and exhibition of contemporary engravings and Spanish graphic work from the 20th and 21st centuries. The museum has an extensive collection of more than 4,000 artworks. Artists represented in the permanent collection include Goya, Picasso, Miro and Dali. People of Marbella because of the Marbella Mosque. The Marbella Mosque was the first mosque built since the Christian reconquest of Spain in the 15th century. It was built by Prince Salman of Saudi Arabia in 1981 and is a splendid example of contemporary Andalusian architecture inspired by the Moorish heritage. The mosque is surrounded by well-maintained Mediterranean gardens and contains a library collection of 30,000 volumes which focus on the Quran studies. The reasons provided in this video are not all the reasons why people love Marbella. If you've got a reason why you love Marbella, pop it in the comments section. I'll make another video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Ciao for now!